Okay, we're going to show you a new style of cable lockout device. This will be very familiar to many people. This is the ProLock. Uh, it comes with a cable, length of cable, one and a half meters long, and this small locking head. Uh, the new lock we're going to introduce to you today uh, is this one, which is called the Cabo Lock, patent pending. Uh, first thing you notice is it's quite a bit larger. Um, there's a few more padlock holes shown here and the tool, this is the tightening tool here and uh, what you'll see as we go on is that this tool can integrate and stay with the uh, locking device when it's not in use. The drive mechanism is this uh, gear mechanism underneath uh, engages with the uh, the same gear in the clamping ring. Another important feature is, is that as you unspin it it won't separate. There's this little circlip on the end of the thread here which keeps it retained so these two parts won't come apart. So when we're ready to lock the valve, we wrap the cable around the body of the valve in the usual way, uh, up through the spokes or around the, uh, the rim of the, of the valve wheel. Uh, we place the cable into the body in the little grooves here that, um, that align it, and we start to tighten up. You can initially tighten it just with your fingers. Uh, once it starts to tighten up, take the tool, engage the gear, and tighten up the mechanism. Before I go too tight, I'm just going to pull up the slack here so that we've got maximum um, uh, locking of the of the valve wheel so there's no uh, so there's no slack or movement on the valve wheel. We continue to tighten up the, the, with the tool. Uh, when you feel it's just about as tight as it wants to go, just peer down through the top so you can see the padlock holes aligning. And at that point now, you can put the padlock in place and notice that we're actually locking the uh, the tightening tool onto the body of the device. Now that's an option, you don't have to do that, uh, but sometimes it's convenient to have that kept nearby uh, the cable lockout so it's always available and ready. Um, another important feature is, is that all of these holes line up. You can actually put up to, although there's 14 holes, two of them are covered by the body underneath, So, but you can still put 10 padlocks. Um, so if you're in a multi-lockout, multi-group operation, uh, as I say, you can get 10 padlocks in place. Uh, once you're ready to remove, it's just a reverse. Put in the key, remove the lock. Um, if you don't want to lock the tightening tool in place, just, just remove that and then you can put the padlock straight back through and then once again, that's locked. Okay, uh, so like the ProLock unit, this is available in red, yellow and green. And you'll notice also there's this little clip on the back uh, this is handy for, you can carry it on your belt or as a means of, if I just use the green one, uh, yeah, as a means of just retaining the cable in place as a, just a little handy, handy little retainer like that. So there we go, we're introducing the Cabo Lock cable lockout device.